The Unclaimed Financial Assets Authority exists to, among others, receive unclaimed financial assets from holders of these assets, safeguard and reunite the assets with their rightful owners. Institutions holding assets presumed abandoned are required by law to file reports and surrender assets before the first day of November annually for the 12-month period. The assets reported range from unclaimed salaries and wages, royalties, unclaimed client monies and loan credits. Others are dormant account balances, unclaimed repositories, unit trusts, dividends and matured insurance policies. In the just concluded compliance cycle year, institutions holding unclaimed financial assets have surrendered 2.58 billion shillings, over 100 million units of abandoned shares and 205 safe deposit boxes. This now brings the tally of abandoned assets being held by the Unclaimed Financial Assets Authority to 13 billion shillings in cash, 555.5 million units of shares and 1,451 abandoned safe deposit boxes. Unclaimed Financial Assets Authority Acting Chief Executive Officer Caroline Churchir is advising members of the public to search for status of unclaimed assets under their name and lodge claims as per the guidelines for reunification. Churchir says to date, 5,871 claims amounting to 327.09 million shillings have been lodged with the Unclaimed Financial Assets Authority. She says the authority is banking on the use of the mobile platform to deepen reunification by enabling mobile phone users interact with unclaimed financial assets database where the list of apparent owners of reported unclaimed assets is published.